Greetings all. Today I'm going to disassemble this disposable vape. It's a, I'm not really familiar with the brands, but and they all are mostly similar. Hi, Hayate Pro Ultra, and it's that's the flavor. <clears throat> so some of the tools I'll use. Basically, something to pry it off using something like this to basically get in between there. The first thing I'll try is to just snap off the top. Um, I'm not going to use any of these parts, so I don't really mind damaging it. My, I'm mostly after the battery, and I like the USB ports that are here. The charging port, so I'll be trying delicate with that. Something just to go over that. Um, so just to take the top off, I'll leave this for now. You, I can take this off actually, just expose it. Use gloves because you don't know what the nicotine is or whatever that's in the chemicals in there and then this can come off slowly however oh okay sometimes they are attached via the cable but in this case there's just um, pins there that press onto the metal one that's nice so we can freely get there next thing the other side I'm gonna use something maybe thinner if you don't have it you can always use like a, like a like a knife or something just to get around a little bit more stronger around the whole edges and there we go it comes off this one's relatively nice and I, and I like that some of them these ones there's a I think it went like that so that you can see see through here and you can even take that as well if you want to use it for a certain project. Anyway, so that's for something else. <clears throat> Pull price slowly off here, and this plastic should come off. Granted, it's my first time doing this one, so I'm going to be learning as I go. Usually, there's screws at some point. Whether this just flicks off yet, yeah, looks like I can push this off. And it clips off. Really nice design on this one. There we go. And you can actually utilize this in a project. So it has the BMS on it, it has the, the battery, it's chargeable, um, let's have a look, and this is where it activates, so this way. there we go, so if you blow in that direction, uh, you should get a percentage, I can't really make out what that percentage is, uh, it's flashing, I don't know if you can see it, flashing low, yeah. So blow in that direction and it's flashing low so it needs a charge let's have a quick look at what this battery is hopefully we don't have to peel it off yeah we do have to peel it off because the labels stuck They're stuck on the label side and what battery is this 3.7 volts obviously and it doesn't say the MAH it just says the watt hour, so you'll have to do the calc calculation to figure it out. And that's the battery size 17350. And if you can see it close up, so yeah, I feel like this is really nice. I don't think you need these. 
you probably have to somehow actually I can give you a close-up of the board easy put this back not a problem on this side yep so this seems to activate only when it, um, it this, these sensors here are activated all right so thank you for watching I hope you found this video useful if you like these sorts of content feel free to subscribe and like if you found this useful as well thanks a lot have a nice day.